Hey YouTube, Dawson Ryder here with a little bit of quick Power Rangers news. Some kind of unexpected news dropped today. I mean, not unexpected. The other day we did get news about this, about the Power Rangers Cobra Kai crossover figures. I just didn't expect it to drop so randomly, at least from my point of view. And honestly, when we very first got the announcement of these, like when I first saw the listing or whatever, I thought they were going to be kind of similar to the Turtles figures, where it was going to be like a Cobra Kai figure and then a PR figure in a two-pack. But these are actually like hybridized designs similar to the Turtles or the Street Fighter figures, except there's no corresponding story, at least at the moment. And so we got our first three announced. They are up on Hasbro Pulse as of right now, and they're also going to be Target exclusives. So our first three are Daniel LaRusso as the sort of white ninja ranger. It's kind of a slight remold of the white MMPR Season 3 ninja suit. He's got, like, you know, no gloves on, and you got, like, a different symbol in the middle, and you got a Miyagi-Do thing on the back. And you have, like, obviously alternate heads. You have the masked version, and then you have, like, the Danny... Uh, civilian head. It looks like a little older though, like the picture looks like a gray-haired version. Like, his hair's not that gray in the show, I don't remember it even being gray in the show, but anyway. And then we also have his daughter, Sam LaRusso, as Pink Ninja. Again, Miyagi-Do thing on the back, slightly remolded, Sam head sculpt. And then, honestly, what might be my favorite in a way is like the skull putty based off of the skull Halloween costume from the original movie. Like, it's basically got, I think, the same putty sculpt, but it's got a skull suit on. I think I just dig it because it's rather unique, and also because it's, like, Halloween time, so I think it fits in nicely. Obviously, we're not going to get this in time for this Halloween, but I think it'll be a fun one to put out with, like, my Hall Halloween figures decorations. And so I, I really kind of dig that one. And I'm very pleasantly surprised by these, although I am really quite upset that they didn't start with the main character and the real Karate Kid, Johnny Lawrence, instead of uh, Danny LaRusso, the true villain of the series, because everything spiraled when he wouldn't let Johnny just be happy in the first season. Calm down, Dawson. Calm down, Dawson. And a little bit, like, truly disappointed we didn't start with Johnny, uh, but I get a feeling we'll see him later. And like I said, I'm pleasantly surprised that these aren't just, like, two packs, that they're actually these cool little hybridized designs. I think it's kind of a fun what if. I don't really want there to ever be a story based on these, unless it's, like, a fun comic, but I just like the idea of them. Uh, and then, it's, you know, it's kind of, it makes sense. They're going off of the MMPR Season 3 ninja suits. I think that works rather well. It would be kind of cool to maybe see them try to make an actual ranger helmet out of these, but I think these make the most sense. And so, with this, we have a certain amount of ranger suits left, assuming we're only using those, and a certain amount of characters. So I imagine we'll, we'll probably do Johnny and Miguel, and then I think on the table is also potentially Robbie, Hawk, and then I would guess Tori, because I'm going to guess they're going to want to have two girls. I think it would be cool if we did something like, I don't know, like, I'm not necessarily predicting the colors, but, like, Tori would be yellow, and then do, like, Robbie is, like, blue or black, and then you have uh, Johnny is, like, red or black or blue, and then Miguel is one of them. And then that kind of leaves Hawk out. Um, I think that it would actually be really cool to see, like, a Green Ranger one. Like, a lot of people have actually said they would cast Robbie, like, fan cast Robbie as reboot Tommy Oliver, which I could totally see. So I guess it doesn't matter. I guess you could do Robbie or Hawk for this. But I think it would be cool, you know, since we only have a certain amount of Ranger colors left, we know that if for one of them, be it Robbie or uh, Hawk, we do a Green Ranger uh, MMPR Season 3 suit. I think that would be cool because it would both be neat to have something uniquely Cobra Kai, but also it would be neat to have an almost what-if MMPR Season 3 Ninja Suit. And then there's also, of course, stuff like villains like Kreese and Terry Silver, which I'm not sure what they would fit that into. I mean, obviously we did kind of this interesting putty thing. It would almost be funny to have, like, a weird Goldar Kreese hybrid or a Lord Zed uh, Silver hybrid. I don't think they'd do that, but I'm just picturing, like, a weird, like, Kreese head on Goldar's body and slightly redone. I don't think they would do something like that, but I'm trying to think how they would fit those in. Unless they give them, like, dark versions of the ninja costumes. I don't even know if they'll do uh, villains like Crease and Silver, but I like what they're going for here. I'm very pleasantly surprised. I'm looking forward to getting these. I hope Johnny's definitely the next one. I think he should have been the first one since he's the main character. Calm down, Dawson. I think that'd be cool. I'd be interested to see the other lineup. Again, I imagine uh, for sure we'll get like uh, jo Johnny and Miguel but I don't know about what the other ones will be. But which ones would you like to see for the rest of the lineup? And what color designations would you like to see? Would you like to see it maybe an original uh, Green Ranger suit like I talked about? Let me know in the comments as always. Until next time, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and climb the steps, ring that bell. Single for my videos. Dawson Ryder, signing out.